Today, we are honoring Zuleha Keto, a daughter, sister, friend, ballerina at the National Theater of Sarajevo, a contemporary dancer with the Balkan Dance Project, a platform which unites dancers and choreographers from the Balkan region and former Yugoslavia. She's a dance teacher who is bringing contemporary dance to Bosnia and Herzegovina, where this dance form is still at the beginning of its development. She's a passionate dance professional, and she's on a mission to popularize classical ballet and contemporary dance in Bosnia and Herzegovina. Through her education and collaboration with different choreographers and dancers from around the globe, she hopes to open the Sarajevo dance scene to the world. Well, I started dancing by accident, and it's the most beautiful accident that happened to me. I went to the musical school to learn to play piano, and at the same time, there was the audition for classical ballet, and there was my mom, which asked me, who asked me if I want to try ballet, and I was like, sure, let's try. Let's see how this goes. So I finished the audition and then I started the classical ballet school as well as piano school. So from that moment on, it was really a love at first sight. Then I became a professional dancer with the national company. I finished the high school. And when I was 13, I think, I started professionally dancing at the National Theater in the ballet ensemble. So yeah, this was a really great and big turning point in my life when I figured out, okay, this is going to be the career for me. This is what I will be doing for the rest of my life. Now I'm committed to dancing and being on stage. I'm committed to popularizing classical ballet and contemporary dance here in Sarajevo and Bosnia and Herzegovina because I've been teaching and going to also different cities in Bosnia and Herzegovina. I'm trying to bring contemporary dance here because the contemporary dance scene is non-existent in terms that we don't have uh, any professional company, we don't have professional education, we just have dancers who are in love with contemporary and who want to bring contemporary productions to Sarajevo or do contemporary productions. I don't know what the future brings and how it will turn out, but my mission now is to dance, to give away my knowledge about dance, and to popularize it here so that people know that dance exists, that classical ballet exists, that contemporary dance exists here. And during the years, I have uh, got to know that really we have so amazing dancers, amazing, talented children, and it's been a pleasure to work with them. So I hope that with time, it will expand and that we will open up to the world so that the world will also know about us as well as we know about the world, you know, by coming here from a small city, a small country, I always wanted to open my mind to the globe. My superpowers, oh, hmm. well, I would say my superpowers are that I love to give away everything that I have learned, you know, to help others with technical things or with creative artistic things, to, you know, give away my knowledge to children. I love to work with children. And I have this energy I have a lots of energy that keeps me really for doing so many things at once you know dancing and then coming home and then doing some classes afterwards so I would say energy and having this amount of energy is for sure my superpower also you know pushing people to their limits and you know, pushing them to be the best of themselves. And this is something also that drives me to be better and to become a better person, to become a better dancer, to become a better teacher. So yes, that that are my superpowers, I think. I use these superpowers by encouraging them, you know, to 
open themselves up, to bring themselves uh, out in the world, you know, to be brave with dance, you open yourself up, you deal with your emotions, you open them to the world. So it's been uh, quite an experience to watch you know, women from a young age to getting older, because I work, work also with older women, you know, how uh, dance has empowered them to be who they are and to, you know, become a superwoman in everyday life.